Herbal medicine is just part of the everyday struggle for the indigenous peoples of South America in protecting their culture and natural habitat. The destruction of the rainforest has seen the disappearance of many valuable medicinal plants and herbs. Herbal medicine has long been practiced in the Amazon and Orinoco regions and from the Andes regions to the humid plains and into the cities too. The arrival of the conquistadors saw a wide variety of these plant medicines noted and documented, many of which are still used today in infusions, poultices, teas and powders. Since the 1950s, botanists from around the globe have studied the Amazon area and its great wealth of medicinal plant life, and this has resulted in them gaining much knowledge. However, this saw a dramatic decline in the latter half of the last century with the reduction of the forest, and it still remains a threat today. Many trees have now been planted in the area to recorrect the balance of nature, but still more needs to be done in order for full restoration to be completed quickly. Similarly to the shamans in North America, the indigenous shamans use herbs and powerful local plants to communicate with the spirit world in order to heal the patient. In many cities, there are large herbal markets where you can find native medicines and traditional herbs, some of which are used in conventional medicine. Research into herbal medicine is now expanding in South America with companies investing and developing medicines used in the traditional way, and this is proving to be more effective than conventional drugs.